Kramer's Road. Um, this is just an example. Um, then um, this a and two is it, um, it is just uh, a coefficient. It is not a squared or b squared or something. It is just a coefficient. Next is um, the determinants. Determinants is not equal to zero. Remember it. Determinants is not equal to zero. So let's write the determinants formula. First is the T and this sign. I don't know what is this called, but it's kind of weird. Determinant is not equal to zero. This is determinant. So what we're going to do is to find the x, find x, and find y. So in order to do that, The formula for finding x is this. So let me explain. Kapag hinahanap siya sa x, kapag hinahanap natin sa x, hindi natin siya ilalagay. Or kung sino mismo rito, kung, or kung nasan man dito ang x, ay hindi natin ilalagay. Ang x dito ay a, a1 and a2. So, wala dito. Tatanggalin natin siya, ipapalit natin siya sa c. And, ganun pa rin yung b. Hindi pa rin siya, ma, hindi pa rin siya mare replace Hindi pa rin replace ang b. Kaya, dito siya. And x, dahil hinahanap natin ang x, um, i-replace natin yung C dito. For Y naman, napansin nyo, ang Y is B. B1 and B2. Uh, this is just a coefficient. So, Ang y natin is the missing. So, wala rito yung y. I-replace natin si C kasi hinahanap natin is y. Okay. Rob, ay, cut, cut mo na lang, Rob, ha? Pag, ano, napapahinto-pahinto ako. So, um, the formula of x is this after solving this we need to find what is x or what is y so the formula for finding that in this in this are the formula so, go to example.
And then the formula. What is A1? A1 is 5N. The A1 and E2 is 5N6. And what is the formula for finding Y? I mean, for the next step is to locate the B because the formula says it's B. Okay, so, so the B is Y. I mean, 7 and 8. So, ito muna ang formula muna ang gagawin natin for determinants muna ang hahanapin. So, ang gagawin natin is cross multiplication. 5 times 8 equals 40. And 7 times 6 is equal to um, 42. So, lagi pala siyang minus. 42. Ayan. So, pag minus natin. 40 minus 42 equals negative 2. Next is hanapin natin si x. Back sa formula. Pag hinahanap si x, c1 and c2. So the c1 for this is this one and this one. Negative 1 and 1. Next is the p1 and b2. B1 is B, um, B1 and B2 natin is 7 and 8. And then compute natin siya. 1 times negative 1 times 8 is equal to negative 8. Minus 7 times 1 is 7. Negative 8 minus 7 is um, negative 15 negative yan negative 15 yan so why naman formula tingnan formula for y and C <laughs> 5 times 1 equals 5 minus negative 1 <laughs> times 6 equals negative 6 11 so kung Ah, hindi pa tatapos kasi ang nakuwala natin is the determinant of x and the determinant of y. So, kapag hanapin natin si x and y, ito ang formula. Yeah. So, x is equal to dx. Ang dx natin is negative 15 dx is negative 15. Sabi dito, di-divide lang siya sa determinants. So, divide natin siya sa determinants. Ang determinants natin is negative 2. ba? So, pag inikol natin siya, uh, or pag nilagay natin siya sa scientific calculator, ang magiging sagot is 15 over 2. And, ito na siya. Ito na siya. Ang way naman, is dy divided by d. Ang dy natin is this. So, 11 divided by the determinant which is negative 2 is equal to eleven and 2. And Ganun lang siya kasimple. Pero, mayroon pang isang rule si Kramer, which is the triangle method.
ito ay Kramer, Kramer rule din. So let's start about let's start with the uh, example. Wala na siyang example na A B and C ganun. Let's start na ta start na tayo kasi example. Kung napapansin nyo, tatlo na sila. Kanina, dalawa lang. Ngayon, tatlo na. Uh, medyo mahirap ito. Pero, medyo madali lang din. <laughs> Ganun. Tapos, for the determinants, ang gagawin natin, para mahanap natin siyang determinants, which is um, the triangle rule, rule or the method of triangle. So, first, let us find the determinants. Determinants is next for 2. Just uh, look for the coefficient, okay? So, x, the coefficient of x is 1. Next is 4. Next one is negative 2. So, may baba naman. So, baba naman is 1, 3, and 7. Next, 2, 9, Oh, I mean, 1. Uh, magkaiba na yung um, rule nila and the uh, method or the solution for this. They are all different. Next, kung hanapin naman natin si x. Sa paghanap naman si x, aalisin natin ito. Itong x na to. Tapos, ang mangyari, magiging ganito siya. 3, and negative 2 ito muna magiging first which is the D na di ba D kasi A, B, C, and D so D muna which is the 3 sunod follow up natin is 4 and negative 2 next same lang din 1 3 and 7 next is 8 9 and 1 yeah. <clears throat> and next natin is y uh, triangle talaga to pero naging di na lang eh nagdadi ko nasa ano sa una pero triangle sya kasi method of triangle na sya so wala naman yan okay naman na next natin is hanapin natin si y so asan si y dito y y y ito si y ito si y diba Pagkahanapin natin siya, tatanggalin natin siya. So, ang magiging ano niyan is ganito lang. Napakasimple lang yun. Una si, una si A, sunod si D, sunod si C. Una si A, kapag Y, kapag Y ang hihanapin na, which is the DY, una, una si A, sunod si, si, si D, and C. Okay? So, 1, 3, and negative 2. Next, same process. 1, 1, and 7. Next, 2, 8, and 1. Diba? So, kapag hahanapin natin si Y, same, um, same formula din, katulad ng kanina. Divide lang natin sa determinants. Yung determinants of y, divide natin sa determinants. So, hanapin mo natin sa y. Pero, bago natin hanapin si y, papakita ko muna sa inyo kung paano sinosolve or paano siya. Um, kung paano ito um, ginagamitan ng 
um, solution or paano siya sinosolve okay so ganito lang siya medyo komplikado kasi sana medyo maganda ang sulat ko um, this is just an example okay uh, 1, 2, 3 1, 2, 3 1, 2, 3 ito ay triangle method so sa nakita nyo is tatlo sila tatlo sila rito isipin nyo uh, this circle are the coefficient so the first thing to do is multiply this row which is this one this line multiply natin yung gantong line sunod uh, gawa tayo ulit next next gagawa tayo ng triangle ito na yung sinasabi natin triangle rule okay so for the triangle is ganito simula tayo dito punta rito punta rito punta rito ito siya ito ang triangle rule next tatlo siyang tatlong beses natin siya i-solve with um, using this kind of method yun yung tatambad na ko sa magsulat so next is after after solving this triangle solve naman natin isa pang triangle okay ito 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 Okay, next step. Um, tandaan natin, pag nakuha natin lahat ng product nito, sa first line, uh, I mean the first, uh, itong unang ito, and this one, and follow by this one, kapag nakuha natin ng product nito, is addition. Addition to. Kasi meron pa tayong next, meron pa tayong next dito which is the subtraction ang mangyari naman babalik na rin sya parang i um, babalik na lang sya pansinin nyo to ok ito yung next natin which is parang babalik na lang ok unang step is ganito pansin nyo, nung unang dito pag ganito, sunod naman pag ganito minus, kasi subtraction na to yung triangle nyo naman pag ganito, magiging ganito sya minus pag ganito naman And these are subtraction. And subtraction siya. So, muna natin si y. I mean, so, muna natin is, hanapin mo pala muna natin is the determinant, which is this. <clears throat> so, ito yung ating determinant so, Diba? Copy lang muna Tapos, tsaka natin gagawin itong triangle method Okay Ganito ang mangyayari First is pag ganito, diba? When times 3 times 1 ay hindi pala kakita ayan ayan muna ito yung um, ito yung sinusolve natin which is the determinants so for the determinants I copy this because this is the determinants and for para makuha yung sagot 
gagawin yung method which is the triangle method ginawa muna natin is the addition so this is the addition and this is um, the way on how to solve it ganito muna so ganyan line 1 times 1 times 3 times 1 1 times 3 times 1 so next is this triangle saan siya? dito 1 times 2 times 9 yan lagayin natin plus plus siya 1 times um, kahit ano pala mauna kahit ano mauna dyan okay lang kasi multiplication naman siya next is the pa ito namang ganito ito siya 2 times 4 times 7 ayan siya tapos imaminus naman natin siya rito okay. ganito ang way naman ng kuha natin para sa add subtraction ganito pag ganito naman which is negative 2 times 3 and times positive 2 minus na negative 2 times 3 times 2 minus ulit para sa um, para sa next triangle so ganda when 1 uh, no, wait, 1 times 1 times 4 um, maganda to sana kung maganda lang sulit ko pero ganyan siya basta triangle siya so hindi lang natin to 1 times 1 times 4 ganyan lang 1 times 1 times 4 minus the last one which is this triangle So, ito na siya. 1 times 9 times 7. Ganyan. Kung ilalagay nyo siya sa calculator nyo, magiging negative 14 siya. Ito na ang ating determinants. So, next. Next na. So, next naman is hanapin naman natin yung y kasi yun muna ang hanapin natin. Sa so y naman, lalagay ko ulit yung y kasi na, na, nasa kabila na. Tingnan natin kung tama. Sa so y is tama na. Ito na ang y. Same process din kapag hanapin natin yung kanina. So, para sa dy, hanapin natin yung addition. So, ganito ang unang step. 1 times 1 times 1 plus yung isa pang step which is the kanito 2 times 7 times 3 plus ulit tapos yung huli na which is the I mean this one yung ganitong triangle 1 times 8 times negative 2 yan minus na tayo so minus na tayo 
para sa minus naman ganito naman siya yung una muna is pagkaliktad ulit ganito minus negative 2 or paganda muna sige para ang ganda paganda sya 2 times 1 times negative 2 minus ulit ganito naman triangle 1 times 7 times 8 1 times 7 times 8 minus ganito naman 1 times 1 times 3 maganda talaga itsura na ito kapag um, naayos siya Um, pero ganito na lang 1 times 1 times 3 minus yan ha 2, 8 1 times 1 times 3 kung ipokompute siya sa calculator ang magiging sagot dito is negative 28 yan so nakuha na natin yung y tsaka yung determinant so sub substitute lang natin siya sa kaninang formula ang formula kanina is ganito Divide lang natin sa determinants. Sa kukunin natin yung y, diba? So, pag kukunin natin, ang y natin is, the neg is negative 28 over the determinant, which is negative 4. Ah, uh, negative 14 pala, sorry. Divide lang natin siya. Negative 28 divided by 14, ang sagot is positive 2. Ganun lang. Same process lang din sa x. Kung hanapin pa yung x, tsaka kung hanapin pa yung z. May z pa tayo dito. Ganun lang. Parehas lang ulitin din yung process. Hindi ko nalalagay kasi mahaba na yung video. Nasa 28 minutes na ako. So, ayun lang. By the way, this, this are what I call, ah, uh, sorry, what they call <laughs> primer primers Ooh. pero iba lang yung method yung kanina method medyo madali lang itong pangalawa madali lang din pero ginagamitan na siya ng triangle method 